Well, uh, you look very happy. Do you feel better after five weeks of meditation? Yes, yes. I feel a lot better, except for the flight, you know, that's quite long, so I'm a bit shattered. But the meditation is great. What exactly have you been doing? How do you meditate? You sit down, you relax, and then you repeat a sound to yourself. And it sounds daft, but it's just a system of relaxation. And that's all it is, you know, there's nothing more to it. So that we meditated for about five hours a day in all, you know, sort of two hours in the morning and maybe three hours in the evening. And then the rest of the time we slept, at, sunbathed, and had fun, you know. Uh, with the extreme poverty that exists in India, presumably you saw some of this. Yes, oh yeah. Uh, I don't equate it, you know, because it's nothing, to, it's nothing to do with it, you know. His idea is to stop the poverty at its root. See, if you just give handouts to people, uh, it'll stop the problem for a day or a week. You know, but in India, there's so many people. You'd, you'd really need all of America's money poured into India to solve it. You know? So the only answer is, and, and then, you know, they'd probably just go back the next year and just lie around, you know. So you've got to get at the cause of it and persuade all the Indians to start working and start, you know, start doing things. Because their religion is very uh, fatalistic. And it's, they just sort of sit down and think, well, you know, uh, God said, you know, this is it. So it's too bad, we can't do anything about it. And Maharishi's trying to persuade them that they can do something about it. Why not purely for a holiday or to meditate? Yes. And uh, what effect has it had on you? This presumably is your first big meditation. Mm. It, uh, I think it calms you down. It's hard to tell because it was so different, life out there. It'll be easier to tell now that I'm back and we're doing sort of ordinary things to see just what it does.